Watch Rise of the Planet of the Apes for a second time. Hey, what's up, everybody? So, I just got done watching Rise of the Planet of the Apes, the 2011 reboot movie. Um, this was my second time seeing it. I haven't seen it since it was in theaters. And when I first saw it in theaters, I thought, yeah, it was good. I didn't think it was great. I gotta admit, Andy Serkis, he is something else. The mocap suit for Caesar. What he did with Caesar, like he did with Gollum for Lord of the Rings, just fantastic. I love James Franco in this. Um, this was $93 million, uh, the budget, and I think it went on to gross like $480 million. It's got like a 77% from the fans and 82 from the critics. Uh, Patrick Doyle actually um, did the score for this, who uh, did Donnie Brasco's score and did uh, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. Uh, Rupert Wyatt directed this. I thought Chris, or not Christopher Nolan, sorry, I don't know why I got Christopher Nolan's uh name on my mind but i thought matt reeves did this whole trilogy i did not know that rupert wyatt did this um so uh there was i grew up with the originals in the 80s uh especially the first one the first one from the 60s is awesome and i went through to watch all of them i think this past december and uh there was a little tidbits back uh to the original movies like the one guy that was working at the facility where uh james franco's character dropped him off um and he was staying at he was watching the uh, charlton heston movie on the tv then you have the line that was thrown out there uh get your stinking paws off me you dirty damn ape that was thrown in this movie and even the cornelius character was in in this it was it was like a he was in a cage, and I was just like, but I think they said that, like, the Cornelius character was a female, um, and I'm just like, wait a minute, Cornelius is a guy, and Zero's the female, so, uh, and I gotta give a shout out to Roddy McDowell, I love him in the original Plan of the Apes, so anyway, um, yeah, the CGI is great, and I think I enjoyed this a lot more the second time, uh, I give it a 7.4 out of 10. I think it's really good. So I'm kind of excited to see the sequel. I'll probably end up watching that sometime tomorrow night um, and see if I like that one better the second time. But anyway, it's like almost 3 in the morning. I'm going to bed. So hopefully everybody has a great Monday. I'll talk to you later.